totally up to date, the most current iPad there is. I think, I, I'm not quite, I mean, it's got the same connector that even the stinker newest iPhones have. Oh, my sweet iPad 4. Mate, she's still going hard. Everyone thinks this is just the case. No, no. So every time you see me smashing a nugget on top of it, I mean, they look, you can see it's I looking back in despair. But tablets, mate, for the longest time, we've wanted to be able to just beep, boom, bink on a stinking screen. It makes all our magical dreams come true. The one we're looking at is like the really famous pop culture one, but I do want to do that Sam Samsung had a really early tablet at some stage. Oh, that's a nugget, that one, isn't it? But this one, you could argue, is the precursor to the iPad. And you know, we're having fun when you got to put these on. <laughs> Ow! Boy, was I excited when I found this. Um, yeah, mate. It's the Apple Newton message pad. Oh, look at this, mate. Faxing. Beaming? Hey, Sprockets, what is this, the Jetsons? <laughs> oh, that's how you know she's old, mate. 1992, they showed this thing off, and I believe it was 93 that they released it. But the thing that got people really excited was the pen, because apparently, mate, handwriting recognition. And this is an Aussie one. Like, that was the best bit, is that I don't need any stupid stinking adapters to make it work. Sell it to me, Apple. Receive messages and more. The optional messaging card allow- Okay, so only if you spend more money, fine. Expandable storage space! Sleep in optional storage card- Oh, right, so you know, you gotta spend money in them. The world's smartest pen! Well, I don't know, mate. The, the paper mate Kilometrico is pretty clever, too. Could take its hat on and off. So, these weren't called tablets back in the day. They were called PDAs. Personal Digital Assistant. I mean, think back to the late 80s. Like, to get calendar updates, five-minute reminders on meetings or something. Like, keeping track of your, your addresses and phone numbers and messages and faxes, it's called a stinking assistant. You would have someone sitting at a desk not far away from you handling all these things. So this son of a dingus cost thousands of dollars in like equivalent monies, right? But you didn't have to employ someone who would then, you know, enrich in their own lives and have a family be happy. No, no, no. Like you can just buy this plastic nugget. Uh, this was a colossal failure. <laughs> <laughs> this did terrible. Uh, yeah, this was way ahead of its time, yeah? So far ahead that people just looked at it and said, mate, I don't, I don't need that, I don't want it. Uh, and yeah, um, we're gonna learn that the handwriting was dreadful, like the Simpsons have done a skit on it. Way back in the day, Steve Jobs and Steve Woz, mate, they made Apple. Well, there was a time where Steve Jobs was sacked, right? And someone else was running Apple. And um, this was during that time. As soon as Steve came back in 1997, he kicked this thing to the curb and he put all the those engineers into better spots and uh, 10 years later the iPhone came out so pff, go on let's get in there look at that that's Australian flavored that makes sense to me yeah whoever had this really looked after it or never used it my Newton information whoa so many styluses styli and these are made of metal listen are you telling me they didn't use their Newton stickers <laughs> <laughs> Mate, put them on the back of my nugget card. People are like, man, where'd you get those? It's like, well, just buy junk from 1993. With my purchase, you receive up and running support for your Apple for as long as you own your Newton. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not gonna try. They obviously have clauses to stop nugget heads like me coming in, you know? Software license, wham. Warranty, wham. Round the clock, round the world, Newton Mail delivers. Wow, like this is what you had to do to get on with email back in 1993 <laughs> in Newton Mail starter kit. Now it's like a crappy app on your bootleg Android thing. And back in the day, mate, Portable email was huge. Gosh, it keeps going. I, I'm used to modern products where they give you nothing, like not even the charging cable. The setup guide. Install the batteries. I mean, this is really well printed. Late braking information. It's not an F1 car. We're not like trying to hit the apex at max speed. Oh, all the handwriting stuff. Don't use fancy business. Don't tell me what to do. Exaggerate the space between words. Space it! Make capital letters twice as tall as lowercase ones. Well, no, you conform to me! There's quite a few rules to making it work, and from what I've heard, it doesn't work. And the handbook. <laughs> all of that, and we're up to the handbook. I mean, like, back in the day, you absolutely would read all of this, because you, know, you just drop the equivalent of, like, $3,000 coins, whatever it is. Sharon says, we'll make the 4 slash 1 deadline. See, I don't know if that's month or day, because Americans get everything backwards. <gasps> oh! Oh! No! What? <laughs> oh, wow, 
on VHS. Um, my VHS player is currently on its way back from servicing, so I don't have it on me. I'm sorry. No need to send me a VHS player. I've got one. It's being beautifully serviced, and I've got to get it back, but... Okay, we're just gonna put that back. <laughs> oh, mate, I'm, I'm having so much fun and we're not even up to the nugget yet. Please read the enclosed license before using the software. Don't tell me what to do. There's our man. What's in there? <gasps> oh. Oh, getting started. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, that's right. It's something in it. Plug this in the wall. Um, that nug. Let's go. Let's Newton. Yeah! So, yes, The Simpsons have done the meme of beat up Martin equaling eat up Martha. Well, here's my go at that very gag. I'm gonna do it for the first time. Ah, oh, damn. What? <laughs> Complete disobedience. <laughs> <laughs> and it seems to be everybody's experience back in the day it was a cool idea. It doesn't work. All right, mate, let me, let me just say something. Dingus. Oh, that was poor. Uh, rings. Okay, no, all right, I'm going to really try now. Okay, let's see if we can get a clean dingus. Dingus. Bridges are good too. Oh, we've got rings and we've got bridges. Mate, this is like a Lord of the Rings sequel already. Let's go once more. Dingus. That's pretty good, come on. Oh, how many times am I gonna do it to get a single? And um, I'm ready to give up. I, I can't get a single dingus. We got rings, directs, bridges, bridges, drinks, rings, bridges, bitters, ages, brigs, bridges, rings, digits, kings. Good. F food? I mean, can it say good? Can it get one? Good. I know there are settings that go in and like do all your handwriting, so that sort of thing, but I've done that. Well, I think we gotta do it again. Oh, God. extras, sharp. I mean, this was actually made by sharp. Oh, fancy. Oh, we're already on max fancy. Uh, personal. What do you wanna know? Oh, I don't care. I don't care. Pen alignment. Pen alignment. Realign. Okay, all right. Can I, can I scroll down? No? What, what do I- Oh, I see. Oh, okay, yeah. It's a manky D-pad. There's no clicking and dragging here, mate. <laughs> Memory internal 8K in use? <laughs> 176K, that is nothing! Well, let's get an extra zen, mate. We, we can just figure this out. There's no games or anything. <laughs> this is- This is just a busy machine. Find. Look for... Oh, no. Ah, oh, to, to s delete something, you're supposed to be able to scribble it out. You gonna do it? No. Oh, jeez. Alright, let's see if we can get rid of this. Alright, scribble out. Good. I'm, I'm good. Excellent. Get rid of King's food. Yes! Good. Alright, get rid of good. Wow! We're doing it! Why can't that go away? Come on! <laughs> no, go away! How do I... Liquor rings directs. <laughs> Sounds like a local store. All right, go away. Yes, now we got it. Yes, delete my pretties. Delete. Why does it do that as well? Like you see the inconsistencies of this. Oh gosh. <laughs> just, I can't get rid of it. It just keeps adding more. Oh good. Dingoes. Burger. That is exactly how Frank would say, Hello, my name is Frank. No, no, no. Dominance is Frank. <laughs> well, let's try the getting started disc, because as far as I'm aware, this thing basically just like keeps your calendar entries, remembers your phone numbers, poorly recognizes your handwriting, and, and then we've hit the limit. So like, sell me. Sell me, Newton. Oh, there we go. This is a getting started card. Look in the extras drawer to find the handwriting instructor. I think you're the one that needs instructing, not me. Oh look, it appears- Oh, get- GAME! A GAME! Calligrapher! We gotta stop from the- the blocks from piling up. You can do this by writing each following word. Oh no! No, this is hopeless! Hints for succeeding. I don't use the Newton, that's mine. Alright, here we go. Idiots! <laughs> I did it!
Come on! Yay! <gasps> Am I having slight bits of fun? Wow, this game's really unpicky. Go on, quick tour. Look at this hot looking mess. You just gonna recognize it? No, it doesn't work that good. Scrub over it with a zigzag. Tina's, that's so close. Now it works. Write the following phrase. Special delivery package. Okay. Yeah, figure that out. Special orient package. Oh. Oh, you could double tap. What if I change you? You can. Uh, okay, special delivery position. Wait, no, that sounds bad. Let's get this move. It's fun how actually simple this guy be, but for the day, this would have just been absolute shrekage of a maze until you go to use it and then you realize it's it's quite balked. <laughs> when uh, Papa Steve came back to Apple, he just canned this, you know. As I said, he moved those engineers to something else. The fact that it's just known in pop culture to just not be that great with the handwriting being the biggest, most like crazy thing. And that's how good it works. Dominance is Frank. Well, I'm gonna yank the guy. Yep, and off she goes. 1993, mate. Pretty cool that she works. Boy, am I glad that even this ancient old iPad 4 looks like a stinking spaceship next to this. Well, that's it. Thanks so much for watching. Huge thanks to my patrons, especially these stinking names right here, because, mate, $1 a month, I direct some videos, but also do my drum stream on Float Plane. That's a hot mess, and you can check out more free vids on Garbage Time, my other channel. There's just no rules, and neither with upload schedules. <laughs> but for $1 a month, mate, on this chair, Patreon ready. Mike, to sell the early 90s to you in my way, and it, you're just gonna have to deal with it. I wanna, it's, this is a drum catalog from 1991. <laughs> There's so much hair in this, right? Like, I'm gonna try and skip over the really boring specific drum stuff. I, I swear it's gonna be fun, and we'll get straight to the pop culture bits. But anyway, thanks so much, mate. I'll see you all next time. Uh, this is just a report that Frank is currently stuck in a paper towel. Yep, she found it. She got in there. It, oh no, she's all the way out. Now what? You've literally become a paper towel. Frank, I need I need to go to bed, you know. I I got work tomorrow. What have you got tomorrow?